Hello there, kids. It is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Kitty Powers' Matchmaker. Alrighty, when we left off, we had gotten up another level and gotten a reputation too fabulous. And, uh, well, we're gonna check on the last two couples we helped. Um, Benedict Sidefoot. Oh, nice! We have a place of our own. We both really enjoy lion taming. We're so compatible that I can easily live with her obsession with goblins. Nutty. The only good goblin is a dead goblin. I did tell one or two white lies, but it was okay in the end. We're really happy together. This could be for life. Well, that's good. Yay! Let's hope for two. Miriam Wiglot. Oh, no. Raiden's just dumped me. We're going to stay friends, though. I was, like, totally in, into his love of pet tarantulas, but they were like, no, I don't think so. And I didn't even care about his all-consuming desire for visiting stately homes, so, you know, whatevs. I just don't understand what I did wrong. I was only ever completely honest with him. I'm, like, a bit sad, but it's not too bad. Life goes on. Aw, oh, that sucks. Damn it, I never get two good ones. I never get two good ones. Alright, well, let's uh, see how this one goes with this current couple that we're doing. Hmm. Your client has to be impressed too. Oh, yeah, that's right. I had to start with a new one. Um. Let's start with Miss Blue Hair. Alright. Hi, I'm Sarah. I'm a civil servant and I'm looking for a man. Decent job, okay. Understandable why you wouldn't be able to find anyone. Hi there, I'm Sarah. I'm a civil uh -huh. I'm a civil servant and I'm looking for a man. I'm well into CGI effects, spooky old houses, and scented candles. And I live for hazel eyes and dark brown hair. Well, because <laughs> that's me to a T. Okay, um, reckon myself to be methodical. Oh, that might be a problem. Anyway, can you find me my dream date? I that's a type if ever I've seen one. Yeah, civil surgeon, edgy type. That's a new one. All right, let's see. Bruno K. <laughs> First, let's start with her name. Sarah Nibblehoffen. <laughs> To then go to Bruno Gaping. <laughs> wow. Okay. All right. Alternative makeup artist. Ah, horoscopes don't match. She does like his eyes. Don't know enough about. We don't know enough about his personality. CGI effects and... Mm. These likes don't really mesh all that well. Let's try uh, the next one. Ludwig Appleworth. Barista. Yeah, respectful. Uh, Taurus. Horoscopes don't match, okay. Tabletop war games, movie premieres, and microscopic things. You into cells, bro? That's weird. That's weird. And they don't like anything about each other. He likes purple hair because he has purple hair? I'm assuming? Okay, that's just weird. Um, let's check out the next one. All right. Hey! Their horoscopes match, at least. Body piercing technician. All right. Same sort of, uh... Same sort of level of stars. Fair enough, I get you. Uh, into Sudoku, space travel, and ghost hunting. Ghost hunting, spooky old houses. That seems like it might be a good match. Uh, Sudoku. Uh, I like it, but it doesn't seem like it would be something that they would share. Uh, CGI effects and space travel. 
they kind of go hand in hand nowadays because you can't really do much with it now. Eh, it might work out. They do not like how each other looks, though. That is for sure. Um, really, all that we got is that they're the same star quality on jobs, horoscopes match, and ghost hunting and spooky old houses are close enough it might work. Let's check out the uh, last one. This app. Marco Hatlow. Okay, fair enough. Paisley Fleming. not working here bro bodyguard that's a decent job uh the horoscopes don't match the only things again that could even closely match are ghost trains and spooky old houses medieval castles though that might have a bit of overlap too but yeah they like hazel eyes but neither of them got it unfortunate i think the closest we got is marco hatlow here Let's go with it. Yeah! I want to try that new one. There it is! Mario's, Mario's mansion. mansion. My tummy's rumbling just thinking about it. Hmm. Sounds good anyway. Uh, he liked black hair, didn't he? Hmm. Yeah, let's... Let's try it. Girl, I know I know you were rocking the blue. I know you were rocking the blue. It was your thing. It was good. I liked it. But we're going to try black hair. See if it works out for you here. You have to earn it before you can spend it. Oh, cock a doodle do. I forgot I didn't have the money. Shit. We'll just go with, the, go with blue and see if he's willing to put up with it. Ah, I keep taking sips of coffee and finding out it's still really hot. Okay, decent weather. Now it's totally my time to shine. Hi, are you Marco? Correct. I would therefore suggest you must be Sarah. Oh God, he talks like a robot. Okay, so fab to meet you. This restaurant sets a new color culinary standard. If I could only fucking talk. Yeah, it's had so many likes. It's unbelievable. Bubbles. Really? All right. <coughs> Good evening. May I take your order? <laughs> yeah, totes. So what's on your food radar? Mm. I would like to ingest a hot, no-meat dish. Mm? I am vegetarian, and therefore meat is out of the question. So absolutely avoid meat at all costs. Otherwise, this date oh, goes very badly. Uh. Also, I utterly refuse to eat mushrooms. Oh, come on! Come on! Okay, it has to be hot pizza marinara. <laughs> to be fair, a little hot and no meat. Uh, pizza marinara. Uh, don't know enough about it. <laughs> Tomato, onion, and garlic pizza. That might work. I'll have two pizza marinara if you don't mm -hmm. mind. A wonderful choice. Mm -hmm. Oh, thank you. Excellent. It sounds deliciously edible. Sure does. Delicious-y. Dear gods, what are you making me say, game? All right. Let's see how this goes. Let's go with occupation. Sure, why not? So, Marco, how do you earn the wonga? What the fuck is Wonga? Okay. <laughs> I am presently occupied as a body piercing technician. <laughs> Wowzers, that's like Uber Q. Uber Q. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking kill me. Gratitudes, I thoroughly enjoy my work. Mm -hmm. Are you going to real, real reveal your occupation, Sarah? Mm -hmm. Be honest, a civil servant. Mm -hmm. Actually, I'm a civil servant. Uh, it is statistically average, I would estimate. Mm -hmm. 
It's okay, you know. <coughs> eh, it wasn't gonna be a wowser all over. Dinner is served. <coughs> Alrighty, let's see how that goes. Well, horoscope was the best thing I had. Let's go with it. So, are you into horoscopes? Oh. I think they are totally illogical. <laughs> Shall I, you know, tell the truth? <laughs> I think they're really, like, spot on. Oh, no. We are not in agreement on this subject. Uh-oh, my tum-tum's going totally gurgling. I can totally feel something brewing. Oh. I literally have to try and hold it in. I mean, to be fair, he shot on... Metaphorically speaking, he shot on fucking horoscopes, so do you really want to hold it in that badly? Okay, here we go, and clench. Flatulence rarely goes down well on a date. They've got to try and hold it in. Okay. Forget the following sequence of cards correctly to spare their blushes and their noses. Well, we can try. Uh, queen is pretty good. Yeah. Lower, nice. Totally still clenching. Ah. Uh, lower? Game, give me something better here. The pressure's increasing. Yeah. Lower? Oh. Mm. I give you this, he got a lot of bass to it. Oh dear. Mm. Ugh, what is that noxious gas I have detected? Ermager. <laughs> Oh my god, I'm funny! <laughs> oh my god, okay. Uh, I'm, I'm collected now. I'm collected. What shall I tell them? It was me! I'm like so embarrassed it was me. Oh! I diagnose chronic gut rot. Please seek medical attention. <laughs> oh my god, this is like totes and Baramundo. <laughs> What's more, Baramundo is having me read the word in Baramundo. Oh my god, please just stop. <laughs> oh god, this is going so badly. Ooh. This is going so bad. Ooh. Oh no. Everything is going Ooh. wrong. When in a relationship, do you Ooh. like to know where they are Ooh. or let them roam as they please? Mm. Let me think about that. Uh. Mm. Let them roam as they. I was expecting methodical. Are you kidding me? Ooh. Are you kidding me? With the uptightness you gave about farts and. This goes badly, this goes badly, fuck it. Where they are? Oh, I'd like to know where they are for sure. It would be less, it would be expedient to worry less. We don't have to agree on everything, you know. They're psychologically illogical. Yeah, a little bit. This date is an inefficient use of my time. Apologies, I have inadvertently left the cat on its own. Goodbye. Oh, how dare they? That was an epic fail. Oh. I'm sorry. That didn't go so well. I'll just have to get over it. We're diametrically opposed. <sighs> oh, no, that's gonna knock me down to great. Your reputation level has gotten worse after that date. Making good matches will improve your reputation. Yeah, if only I could with what you gave me. You gave me not a lot. All right. All right, let's see. Let's see if we can... <laughs> Getting dumps a real kick in the face. You're not wrong. You are not wrong. Ah... Uh... Frankie Cherry Long, huh? And Evan Red Long. Are they related? Anyway, let's check yours out. You're Rhodey. You're also a Leo. You like his hair. Okay, good. Good. 
uh, reading science papers, looking at microbes beta software. So a bit of a geek. Okay, gotcha. Um, really, all we got is horoscopes, but... Well, I mean, maybe CGI effects. Maybe. Let's see how it goes. Sure, we're going to do it. I have no idea where the fucking thing I wanted was. I got it anyway. Mario's Mansion, hey? That's a fancy choice. Yeah, relatively. We can actually do the hair color now, right? Yes, it would be 25. I have 30. Good. Um, what was it he wanted? Uh, purple. Okay. You could do that. Cool. Purple will work. It's barely a change from your other hair color. Let's go with it and see how it goes. We don't do team deathmatch in this game, but we do do team love match. Really, Kitty? Really? Raining. Gotcha. All this excitement. Please just kill me. Drinking coffee. Hiya, are you Frankie? Uh, yes, I am. You must be Sarah. Oh, we finally have a normal one. Okay. So fab to meet you. You're right on time. It'd be like so shady to keep anyone waiting around. Ooh, this place is very fancy. Yeah, it's had so many likes, it's unbelievable bubbles. You made me say it again. I'm living for your dark brown hair. Thanks, I just had it done. Lovelier locks than a luxury locksmith. That was brilliant, actually. I love that. Thank you. <laughs> that was actually a great joke. It had me thinking for a second. I do love your purple hair. Thanks. That's well kind of you. <clears throat> wow, that is a beard. That is the beard I used to have when I started this fucking game. Good evening. May I take your order? Yeah, totes. What's on your food radar? I'd like something hot with no meat. Vegetarian, so I never eat meat. Ow. Didn't give me the one I did. Pizza I fungi. I'm assuming that's how you're supposed to pronounce that? I don't know. But, I mean, it's hot. Doesn't look like it'd be meat. Calamari fritti. I know for a fact that has to be meat. Minestrone. Insalata Kaiser. Uh, I think that's a salad. Gonna take a chance. I'll have two pizza eye fungi, if you don't mind. <laughs> Wonderful <laughs> choice. <laughs> Sounds delicious. Sure does. Delicious Rooney. <laughs> hey, it worked out. Nice. Gotta love when that happens. Uh, love handle time. Alright, let's go with weather. Because it sucks. <laughs> um, pardon me? Uh, it was bad weather. It was rainy. Yes, it was, wasn't it? Right then, that's the weather pretty much covered. This is all highly fascinating. That was the best I got. <clears throat> Dinner is served. Ah. All right, there we go. And horoscope was good, so let's go with that. Are you into horoscopes? I think they're nonsense. Mm, sorry, girl, we've ran into two dates who don't like horoscopes. We're going to have to lie about it. This is, it's just the only way we can make this work. Okay. Ah, uh, please, please stay on green, please. Oh, uh, mm. thank you. They got away mm. with it. I think they're complete pants. Ooh, what? Uh, yes, astrology is such a piffle. Yeah. Totes. <laughs> okay. Um. Uh, you're going to have to overlook that a little bit, girl. You're going to have to, to make this work out. Excuse me, I'm just going to the restroom for a moment. Okie dokie. What is he going to change? What is he going to change? He grew a mustache? How do you man 
manage to grow a mustache in a bathroom trip. Not only that, you didn't even grow that much of one. That is like three steps above Hitler stash. What the fuck is that? What the fuck is that? There are no words. There are no words. Everything all right? I just wanted to adjust my look. What do you think? How you managed to do it, I have no idea, but you you changed your facial hair. Yeah. Wowzers, you're just so hip. Ah, thank you. I love compliments. It's amazing what you can do in five minutes. Yeah, apparently grow a fucking mustache. The fuck? Nice. I needed that. Oh boy, did I need that. All right. And, okay, we're going to have to hope for the best here. Organization, as far as your car goes, do you do regular maintenance or drive it until it blows up? Probably do regular maintenance. Oh, thank you, merciful Jesus, someone who is normal-ish. Okay, so how about you? Oh, do regular maintenance for sure. Uh, mm, Aren't we the organized pair? Yeah, <laughs> Just like me you are. Mm, Should we get the bill? Mm, the waiter's here somewhere. Mm, I've literally forgotten what they looked like. Mm, they had the glorious beard Dougie right here. <clears throat> yeah. I do apologize. Here is your bill. <laughs> Anytime. Yeah. Well spotted. I'd forgotten what they'd look like. Yeah. My memory is like literally photographical. No, it is not! You lying little shit! I suppose we should call it a night. No problems, let's go. I mean, ooh, I think they're absolutely gorge. The things you make me say on this show. Alright, uh, will you go out with me? So, how's about using me? Yes, I think I'm in love with you. Oh my god! That's the ticket. Yeah, oh. we finally managed to make it work. Uh. Uh. This week we chose the wrong guy the first time. We chose the wrong guy. It was just... It, was, it wasn't meant to be. It wasn't meant to be. That was what the problem was, you know? Promotion. Oh, yeah, mopper upper. Back up to fabulous. Hells yeah. Alright, that went... Better than the last one. <laughs> oh, first failure. No. You're doing well. You leveled up again. Yay! Let's upgrade the agency. Let's do it. Ooh. Another story. And another personality trait. Uh, let's go spiciness. I'd certainly want to know if my date is sweet and lovely or a rampant beast. <laughs> you had to add the growl, didn't you? <laughs> oh shit. Alright, 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 alright. All right. You know what, Kitty? I'm okay with this. I'm okay with this. <laughs> it's fine. It's good. It's alright by me. Alright, let's check. Uh, the salon. Ooh. Salon barber and makeup artist. Hmm. Good to know. And we also get another page of Kitty's Black Book. Hmm. Well, let's see what we can get with the money we have before we start spending it. Yeah. Perfect. And we'll try one more. One more. Get them started, and then we'll see how it goes. Uh, let's go with you. You've been waiting for a bit. Hi, I'm Tyrone. I'm a wig stylist, and I'm looking for a man. Wig stylist. Hey. I'm a wig stylist, and I'm looking for a man. All right, let's help our gaze a little bit, huh? 
Gotta love it. All right. <laughs> yeah. I'm interested right. in conspiracy theories, FPS games, and social networking. Interesting combo. <laughs> All right. And I have a preference for blue eyes and blonde hair. Okay. All righty. He is looking for... Uh, mm. Yeah, yeah. Not sure. Yeah. <laughs> Look at describe yourself as methodical and romantic. Mm. Yeah. Can you locate nice. a suitable love match? I'm sure they're a geeky type. Bless. <laughs> yeah, a little bit of a geek. A little bit of a geek. Let's look at Marco again. Yeah, that wasn't. I figured the horoscope wasn't going to go well. You do like his eyes. And we know that actually doesn't work. Keaton Nickerkins. <laughs> ah, the alliteration. Keaton Nickerkins. Oh, joy. Okay. Oh, you like each other's hair. That's great. That's great. That is great. Zombie movies and FPS games. Some of them overlap. That works. Archery, uh, bar hopping, that, that actually is not bad. And they match with horoscopes. This might actually work out. Let's do it. Let's do it. Let's go to the Italian restaurant again. Uh, nice try. I knew where- Mario's Mansion, how exotic. We're not looking for exotic, Kitty. We're looking for Fancy. All right, so your hair already is wonderful enough for both of you. Just gonna go with it. Ooh, I can drink more of my coffee because it's cooled down a bit. Raining. Gotcha. I would cross my fingers, but that would be irrational. Oh God, You're gonna be one of those, aren't you? Greetings, fellow human. I would surmise you are Keaton. Uh, mm. Yeah, you must be Tyrone, right? <laughs> mm. Most gratifying to make your acquaintance. Don't they look nice together? Why the air quote nice there, kitty? Uh, Ooh, this restaurant uh, is well swank, too. Uh, mm. It is arguably the, in the top percentile. I can't fucking tuck. Uh, your blonde hair is giving me a pleasant sensation. Uh, <laughs> Thanks, it's literally all mine as well. Ooh, your blonde hair is so current. I appreciate you giving me this information. <clears throat> wow, that is a hairstyle and beard style, my friend. God's damn, you rock it. You rock it, man. Fucking rock the pompadour and the fucking mutton chop mustache combo. Handlebars, I don't fucking know. I don't fucking know names for things. All I know is that rocks. Good evening, may I take your order? Uh, mm, Affirmative. Mm. What is your preferred sustenance? Mm. Something cold with no meat would be fabuloso. Uh -huh. I'm totes vegetarian, so meat's a no-go. All right. Oh, great. And you give me the ones I don't know. Um, well, I kind of technically have to go for the achievement anyway. Um, hot with no meat, right? Minestrone. Uh. Homemade vegetable and noodle soup. Well, I mean, soup's usually hot, right? Ravioli di manzo. Uh. Beef filled pasta parcels. Oh, yeah, that is not gonna work. Let's go with minestrone. Uh. I will require two rations of minestrone, uh. please. Uh. A wonderful choice. Uh. Oh, come on. I'll just make do with that then. Isn't that exactly. Uh. I thought that was what you asked, wasn't it? Am I, am I that bad with Italian food? Uh, I probably am. Let's be honest here. I probably am. Spiciness. Uh, when you're on a, your holidays, would you prefer mm, a trip to a fairy tale castle uh, or a beach full of bronzed bodies? Mm, oh, great question. Uh, I'd say a beach full of bronzed bodies. <laughs> uh, I don't know. I'm somewhere in between. Somewhere in between there, I think. Hmm. Oh. Uh, would lying or telling the truth be more expedient? We gotta, hey. gotta try the lie. Gotta try the lie. Just at least here. 
Make him think that you're a little kinkier than you are. That's it. Oh, no. Fuck. Try it again. Please, for the love of God's work out. Okay. All right. It might. It might. Yeah, it's going to work out. Just, I don't get money out. Damn it. Hmm. Definitely a beach full of bronze uh -huh. bodies. Ooh, I'm quivering with anticipation. <laughs> we are apparently very similar. They're kindred spirits. I'll have a double. <clears throat> right. Dinner is served. Okay, well, we already had to lie once. Try not to lie multiple times. Alright, let's go with... Ah. Yeah! Occupation! Uh -huh. Please tell me your occupation, Keaton. Yeah. Well, I'm a trapeze artist at the Momo. Somebody's got to do it. <laughs> oh, no. You dislike it. Uh, that sounds suboptimal. Okay, whatevs. So, Tyrone, how do you keep oh. busy? Well, I mean, we kind of shit on his job. Let's just be honest about what ours is. Uh, mm -hmm. I'm, I'm currently employed as a wig stylist. Uh, Ooh, that's pretty awesome. Wow, he actually liked it. Uh, All right. Mm -hmm. Affirmative. It is certainly above the median. <clears throat> no, 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 no. Can I interest you in something from our dessert trolley? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's like totally naughty, but I'm a bit peck peck for the pud pud. Peck peck for the pud pud. Are you kidding me? <sighs> okay, then. Very good. I shall fetch the trolley immediately. Uh. I did not factor in the appearance of a dessert trolley. I did not factor in his response to it. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god, they look totally delish. Okay, so vanilla ice cream, double espresso, espresso, Knickerbocker glory, fruit salad. That doesn't count as a dessert. Neither does that one. <clears throat> Bullshit. Which of our handcrafted desserts can I interest you in? Oh, the one after the first first one looks amaze. Okay, I vaguely That's not a dessert either! It took me until I saw it to remember it, but I knew for a fact that it wasn't technically a dessert. And the Knickerbocker Glory was the third. And then the rest of them that weren't desserts were after that. <sighs> double espresso. Yeah. All right. <clears throat> we require one ration of double espresso, please. <laughs> inspired choice. Inspired, <laughs> if I can only talk. I can't wait. I'm gagging to taste it. That's not how that works. <laughs> Their dessert choice was completely predictable. Are you sure about that? Nice. Would have been nicer if I could get it earlier, but <laughs> hand was not on the controller. And interests maybe will work out? Wait, horoscope might work out. Better. What is your opinion of horoscopes? I think they're everything. Oh, no, man, this is not the thing you want to screw me on. Dude. Dude, you're, you're, kid you're killing me here. You're killing me, Smalls. You're killing me. All right. I love it. All right. Oh, shit. Maybe... Let's go again. Okay, please, 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 please work. Please work. Okay, it's in the greens. We're good. We're good. We don't get money, but it, we're good. I think they are transiently entertaining. I am pleased we agree. My star sign's Capricorn. How about yours? Mine is Taurus. Is this good? Oh, my MG, we're like totes compatible. Excellent. Our futures are well in placed for success. <clears throat> well, at least you liked that it worked. Here is your bill. I hope you enjoyed your meal. What amount should we tip the restaurant employee? I reckon they deserve, totally deserve about 12%. Fuck. Um, 
Okay, so 10% would have been about three, and another 2% on that would... I want to say it's 477, but I'm not sure. Ah, phone, help me. Help me, phone. You're my only hope. I totally did not have it in front of me just for the reason that I would be trying to, you know, cheat -see doodle but I have it here in case of emergencies, so I might as well use it because this is an emergency. Uh, yes, I was right. Fuck yeah. <laughs> yeah. Here's the agreed monetary bonus. <laughs> Ooh, a bit of a brainiac, aren't you? I, I managed to get it right. I just wanted to double check that I was right. That is my story and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> my brain is functioning at normal levels for a genius. I think it's time to split. It would be expedient for us to leave, though. Let's go do it. And here's hoping it goes well. I have insufficient data to form an opinion. Oh. Now you're the one screwing me. Damn it. Do you envisage, envisage a further meeting? Yeah, it was like really special. Sure. Super optimal. My brain broke on trying to read that. Super optimal. My excitement is about to overload. Right. Their relationship has grown. It went relatively well. I'm like epically in love. Well, I mean, Keaton's into it. Just needing to get Tyrone on board. Fuck yeah. Your humble servant. Moi. Well, I mean, that went well. Could have gone far worse. I mean, considering how the first one of today went, it definitely could have gone a lot worse. So, yeah, we have one more and then the beginnings of another. So, thank you all so much for watching. Watching? Forgive that little cut part. That was me having a stroke trying to do my outro. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share in comments so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see you all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat. Playing games and epically failing the first date. Which went catastrophically bad. And uh, rebounding with a good date. That actually went perfectly. And then another date that we're seeing how it goes. Because uh, mainly our client is not too into it for you.